Hey everyone, my name is Caitlin Bone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be telling you guys about my little fall bucket list I put together. I want to apologize about the Christmas blanket being out too. I went to Marshall's yesterday and found this for $15 and it's like Sherpa on the inside and I couldn't resist. So it's been on my bed today. Anyways, I have my fall bucket list in this little journal. It's just um, a Harry Potter journal right here. Also, this bookmark is super cute. It's a little gold wand, which I think is just adorable. Um, sorry if my cat's being a little bit distracting. She's gonna continue to move around the room as she pleases. Starting off with my first fall bucket list thing is I wanna make pumpkin pie, like obviously. Um, I typically bake a ton of pies at, around the holidays, so I'm excited to do the same this year. Um, it's gonna be a little different just because I can't, you know, go as many places as I would like and that kind of stuff. So I'm trying to be safe, but baking is still one of those things I can do. Number two is I want to go on like a fall, fall excursion with my friends and take Polaroid pictures. Cause I have a Polaroid camera and a bunch of film that's been sitting in a drawer unused. So I need like a reason to use it. So I was like, obviously taking fall Polaroids would be awesome. I want to collect some fall leaves and like dry them out so that I can keep them because I really like it when people can take like dried flowers or dried plants and you know um, put them in one of those like floating picture frames if that makes sense. Number four I want to make Harry Potter themed treats so if you know I've kind of gotten back into my Harry Potter phase recently. I've been like recollecting the books and watching the movies and everything and so I'd really like to make some Harry Potter treats because I wish I had the budget to go visit Universal, but I do not. So I will make the Harry Potter treats at home, but I'm just hoping that I can make some of those with my friends who've also been getting back into it, and that'll be awesome. Number five, I wanna carve a pumpkin, which is gonna be happening very soon because um, my friends and I are going to a pumpkin patch tomorrow. Um, we had to reserve tickets and it's gonna be socially distant. We're just literally gonna go and pick out pumpkins and stuff, or maybe, Maybe we'll just go for the experience because I don't know how expensive the pumpkin's gonna be and pumpkins at Walmart are like $5. Number six, I wanna dress up for Halloween. So I'm dressing up as Hermione because I kind of have like the curly messy hair. I'll have to like tease it and poof it up, but I'm gonna do her and I thrifted a bunch of like my stuff that I'm gonna need for. Number seven, I wanna do a ghost photo shoot. So I know you guys have probably seen that all over like TikTok and everything, those ghost photo shoots that people have been going and doing. So I would like to do one of those. Um, I think that'd be another opportunity to take like some of those Polaroid pictures that I've been storing up. Number eight, I would like to start brainstorming gift ideas for my family for Christmas because um, my parents are divorced. So I get to spend Thanksgiving with one of them and Christmas with the other one and so this year for Thanksgiving, I'm going to my dad's house. So I have to have all my Christmas gifts together for everybody there by then. So I've been like slowly like working on making ideas and everything. So I wanna finish that up so that I have them out of the way before Thanksgiving comes. So I'm not buying them at the last minute. I wanna eat plenty of candy, of course, because why not? Um, so eating candy. Another thing I want to do is jump in a leaf pile because I have trees behind my house so we can usually rake up leaves. It's not cold enough yet that trees are really dropping a lot of their leaves. So it'll probably be in the next month or two that I'll actually get to do that. But I'd like to rake them up and like jump in a pile because I think that's super fun. Bake for people around me. So typically when I would be in school, um, I'm not back in school yet. I'm still doing online learning. Um, I would be like baking cookies and stuff all the time for my friend group and so that's really been sad for me like to not be able to do that kind of thing as much. Um, so I'm definitely looking forward to getting to bake for like more people like even if it's just my family and share it with them. Also trying to work on enjoying more alone time which is another thing on here because I go to college next year and I probably am not going to be in college with my friends. So for a little bit, I am gonna be alone, but I'm also just trying to transition to like, you know, get ready for adulthood because I'm not always gonna have like my friends to tag along and do everything with me. So I'm trying to learn how to enjoy, enjoy more time alone, whether that's reading or going out by myself. My cat is right there, as you can see. I wanna support more, more local businesses. As a small business owner, 
um, my business is in the description. Um, I've learned that like, I really want to support more small businesses. So I'm trying to aim to get a lot of my Christmas gifts from there. I try to go to like more local stores and gift shops or coffee shops, that kind of stuff. I want to go out and drive with a playlist. So I would say I'm a person who's fairly attached to music in the sense that I find a song and like I can just see myself doing doing things to this song so I guess there's like some of the songs that are just very emotionally gripping and they just like make me feel so much happiness inside and so I really want to make a playlist of that on like Spotify or YouTube and just go out and drive it like at nighttime with all the windows rolled down because I think that would just be magical. I don't know. I just, she's laying on the ground. There's this one song off of TikTok that I've been listening to recently that's called Welcome Home Son. I don't remember what the band is called, but it's like the chorus is just beautiful to me. I am obsessed and that was like one of those songs that was just like, yes, I need to do something with this. I want to make caramel apples, so I've already done this once, but I'd like to make them again for fun. I'd also like to make more YouTube content, so if you don't know or if you haven't been following along, I took about a month or a month and a half break from YouTube transitioning back into school because my life got really busy and I was just trying to make sure I still had time like you know to myself and that I was still mentally good and doing everything all right so I'm finally back in the YouTube game and I am here to stay this time and then the last thing that I wanted to do is find more ways to make other people happy because something I've discovered in my life that I think will probably always stay with me is how much making other people happy has always been of value to me as a person because like I love giving gifts or making people smile or just like surprising them and that kind of stuff and so I think that that's something that I really want to focus on doing just because um it's my last year before I go to college and I'd really like to just like you know make my family and my friends really happy and everything that was my fall bucket list let me know in the description if you're gonna do anything based off of my list or if you have anything new to add or if there's anything you think I should add to mine. If you liked this, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. I love you all so much and I will see you next week. Bye!